This is question 7 from paper 2 of the 2014 National 5 Maths exam. We're given an ornament in the shape of a glass cone, but at the base of it, removed, is a hemisphere, half a sphere of the glass, and that's been replaced by copper, to, presumably to make it heavier so that it can sit better. So we're asked to work out the volume of the glass in this ornament. So you would be looking at working out the volume of the cone and then subtracting the volume of half of the sphere. And the radius that we'd be using for the volume of the cone would be a half of this diameter 8. So the radius would be 4 there. And the radius we'd use for the volume of a sphere, or the hemisphere, would be half of the 7.4, which is 3.7. So we'll use 3.7. You'll notice up here I've put the two volume formula. You get these given to you in the exam on your formula. Sheet. So the volume of a sphere is 4 thirds pi r cubed. The volume of a cone is 1 third pi r squared h. So the volume of the cone, let's look at all the uh, information we've got. That's a, a third pi, we'll put the formulas down first. A third pi r squared h and we subtract the volume of half of a sphere. So it's a half of... 4 thirds pi r cubed. Now, important to notice that uh, these two quantities, the r's, are different. That's the radius of the cone. This is the radius of the sphere. So let's substitute values. We've got a third times pi times the radius of the cone which we said was 4, times its height, which is 15. We've then got to take away a half, times 4 thirds, times pi, times the radius of the sphere, 3.7 cubed. Well, let's find out what that comes to. And we can use the calculator to find that. So first of all, one third, one divided by three, multiplied that by pi, times four squared, times 15. Now, as soon as the calculator sees a minus, it'll work its way through this, working it all out. And the, the, the four squared will be worked out first, then the, the division and all these multiplications. So we'll get the correct answer for this, and then it'll work out this series of multiplications. So minus one half, which is 0 0.5, times four thirds, four divided by three, times pi, times 3.7 cubed, raised to the power three. So that all comes to 145.24000. So let's write that down. 145.24, etc. And let's look closely at the question because the question says, give your answer correct to two significant figures. So that equals... 1, 2, we're chopping a 5 off, so it means the 4 goes up to a 5, and it's 150. You think of a number line where we've got 150 and 140, and we are ever so slightly this side of 145. It's 145 in a wee bit. So it will round up to 150 rather than down to the 140. So it's 150 cubic centimetres for the volume of the glass.